Hi, I'm Kathy St. George, and you're tuned in to the Video Outhouse. Ooh, what's that smell? Arr, all hands on deck, you scurvy dogs. It's time for a Ship Shape Update with Comic Book Man. Arr. Hey kids, how you doing? Comic Book Man here. Welcome to my video outhouse. It's time once again for Ship Shape Update, your teachable moment for everything that's shipping to the store this coming Wednesday, the 21st of October 2009. Oh, that's right. First thing up is a shout out. This week's shout out is to the folks at Instant Press who will be doing an in store signing what? here at Alternate Reality on Halloween Day. If you can't remember the date, just remember it's Halloween. Halloween Day, which of course is the 31st of October, they will be here all day signing for their upcoming release, Bride of the Wolfman, which is a comic that Dave Gruba and Renee have both done, they're the two guys who work at Instant Press, along with one or two other folks who come and go on different projects they do, but Dave and Renee will be down here at the store, they'll be signing, they'll have have copies of their book, not free copies of the book. They'll have copies of the book. They'll have free autographs, though. Practice. Free autographs. Yeah, yeah. And and you can talk to them about the book or about comics or about life in general and pretend it's shop talk. And just do a shop talk with them but without the camera. Yes. So be sure to stop by the store on Halloween Day for that event that will be going on here. Also, I want to remind everyone, brightest day and blackest oh, night. I love the rings. If you're a subscriber to the store and you get either Blackest Night or any of the Green Lantern books or both, be sure to let me know because I'm getting 50 sets of these rings in in the month of November and you get to go on the list if you want to get a set of these things for free. That's right, for free. Yippee, not going to charge you for them. Marie. Not I'm not going to milk you. They're not going on eBay. I get 50 rings. They go to 50 subscribers. I got many more than 50 subscribers, but the first 50 who tell me that they want to be on the list get these rings in November. And if you don't tell me and you're not a subscriber, then you ain't getting them for me. Now, moving on. Yes. This week, we got a whole bunch of stuff shipping, but at the top of the list, the big book of the week, the number one book of the week, the book you should care about is... Yes. Justice League of America number 38. That's the one. Why is that? Uh, Why is that? Because the team of James Robinson and Mark Bagley take over Justice League with that issue. If you've been reading Cry for Justice, you know what Robinson's doing over there. Bagley's not the artist on that book, but you know Mark Bagley from Trinity and Ultimate Spider-Man and many other things. They're both taking over the book. This week, and if you come by the store, it's 40% off this Wednesday only, That's along sweet. with seven other books, that are, or six other books yeah, that are actually. shipping this week for our Magnificent Seven. And those are Azrael number one, Dark Rain the List, The Hulk one shot, um, Sugar Shack, or Sugar Shock one shot, which is coming from Dark Horse, which I think is a Josh Whedon. Uh, thing that's coming out. It's a one shot. Well, Dark Horse is doing a doing a one shot project thing where they're doing a bunch of one shots all October and November long, and that's like the first of them. Also, they got these three trade paperbacks: Superman Adventures of Nightwing and Flameberg trade paperback, which has Golden Age stuff and more contemporary stuff in it. Golden Age, Silver Age, I should say, Silver Age. Yeah, uh, silly. Uncle Sam Deluxe Hardcover. That's the Alex Ross Uncle Sam. DC's repackaging it as one deluxe hardcover. And uh, Wolverine Dark, Wolverine Premium Hardcover, Volume 1, Prince, which is the first story arc of the Dark Wolverine run. All those books will be 40% off here at the store this coming Wednesday, the 21st of October. Now, the horse race. This week, once again, DC is in the lead for the horse race. DC's two weeks in a row. Two weeks in a row. Now they're. So. I've got 77 comics shipping this week, which is kind of light. It's kind of light. It's even lighter than last week. And of those 77, DC comes in number one with 20. 20. Can, can you do an effect with the, with the ring? <laughs> I don't know. I'll try. Let's see what I can do. Uh, coming in second. That'd be cool. Coming in second is Marvel with. Use the orange ring. <laughs> 16. Coming in third is Image with. <laughs> Seven. Coming in fourth is IDW with <laughs> five. And finally, wrapping up, the fifth place winner is, for this week is Dark Horse, coming in with <laughs> five titles. And of course, IDW and Dark Horse are both tied at fifth. So oh, IDW comes in there. fourth, not fifth, because of the dollar amount. Uh, IDW's got a total of $19.95 worth of books shipping this week, as opposed to Dark Horse, which is a total of $15.97 worth of books shipping this week. So that's why the fourth and fifth place. And, of course, we have uh, 22 other independent titles shipping this week for your reading and buying pleasure. 
Uh, one thing I want to point out. One thing I want to point out before we get rid of before we get rid of all this. Shoot, comic book man. DC's number one with uh, with uh, 20. twenty titles. DC, if you bought all of DC's titles this week without the discount, it cost you sixty two sixty two dollars and eighty two cents. If you bought all of Marvel's sixteen titles, four titles less, it would cost you sixty four dollars and eighty two cents. Marvel's going to cost you two plus dollars more for four fewer titles this week. You can take that and, and, and mash it and work the statistic whatever way you want, but DC's giving you more books for less this week. And that's my plug for DC. Just point that out. Move it on. Oh, erase, erase, it, erase it. Oh, wait a minute. I don't need to erase it. You don't. Okay. Uh, okay. Use your colon, comic book man. Kids Corner. Kids Corner. Kids Corner, eh? Oh, Jeffy. Yes, comic book man. Jeffy, why, why, why are kids important to us? Why kids are very, very important to us because they're so small and vulnerable. Small and vulnerable. And, like you, can, and you can pack them tight in a balloon and send them off into the sky and wave bye-bye to them and get a reality show. Make, That's why kids are important to they us. They make you famous. Kids are important to us because they get you on TV. My balloon boy is lost! Where's my balloon boy? Anyway, coming it's in this week, boy, shout out. Our, our, our kids' comics this week, we've got Tiny Titans number 21, we've got Sonic Universe number 9, we've got Simpsons Comics number 159, we've got Scooby-Doo number 149, but the kids' book in a week, continuing the tradition, Archie Comics number 602, which is Archie and Veronica in the next step along no. in their imaginary tale relationship of marriage and love and living their lives off together. This is the uh, yet another Christmas story. It's another Christmas story. We had a Christmas Digest last week. This is a Christmas story featuring uh, featuring uh, Archie and his kids and the grandparents, and they're all together on Christmas. And one of them, I think it's Archie's dad, is in the Santa Claus costume, and and they're just having a wonderful time together. And if you if you if you if if you check out the cover, if you check out the cover this no, week, don't do this. take this a look, kids, take a kids, look, take a look for Archie's junk on the cover. That's all I'm gonna say. Just pick up the copy. You don't even have to buy it if you don't want to, but just take a look at Archie's junk on the cover, and it, it it's quite a, it's takes quite a sight. Over, takes you right out of Kids Corner. Anyway, that's uh those are those kids are the corner. comics that are shipping this week for Kids Corner. I also have these magazines. Yeah, what are these magazines? Okay, they come in this week. Now these are magazines you don't normally see at comic book stores, but we get them here at Alternate Reality because I try to get as much stuff into the store for kids because kids are the future of this industry, and kids also need to get stuff that will stimulate their imaginations and you can sit down and have a reading experience and, and a one-to-one -one experience with your kids with magazines like... While well, you're having a moment, comic book man. Baby like Bug. Baby Bug. Baby oh. Bug. Baby Bug. Which, which, is, which is a little storybook for little kids. Oh, sweet. Stone Soup, mm. which is stories for kids that are a little older, say 9, 10, 11. Uh, Stone Soup is an excellent magazine, which has been around for years and years and years, and teachers love it. Uh... Nick, which I'm sure teachers love too, because every issue features SpongeBob in some way, shape, or form. He's an icon. He's an icon, and of course, WWE Kids Magazine with 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 with, with 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 Barack Obama right here and oh. Thor on the cover, and and don't they just look so cute? So those magazines are all at Alternate Grab Reality. Up, you can come down. Loaded. You can come down and pick them up here at the store. Uh, next up is uh, Late List. The Late List. Uh, this week is not a big list for the late list. We've only got 16 titles that were added to the late list this week. There's nothing really spectacular. There's one item that's, that's going to be the uh, basket case of the week, but there's nothing really spectacular. The biggest thing in the Marvel side is Captain America Reborn number 4 has been pushed back to the 4th of November, and Flash Rebirth number 5 has been pushed back to the 11th of November. And that's about it. Uh, there's, uh, there's other... There's, 14 other items, but Check nothing of major significance. The other basket case book, though, for the week is not this, it's because it's number one and I don't have it, but the Iron Man vs. Whiplash number one uh, miniseries, which is coming out to tie in with the movie that'll be out next summer, has been pushed back to the 18th of November. It will not be shipping on time. This isn't it, like I said, but the Iron Man vs. Whiplash, uh, or this that I've got in the basket, whatever graphic is up is it, but this in the basket isn't it. Uh, but it's been pushed back to the 18th of November. So but you need something to put in a basket. You're gonna have. To, I need something to put in the basket. So uh, four. You know, you I could. It. I could use him. He's <laughs> Iron Man too. I should just use him. There you go. Basket case of the week. Iron Man bobblehead. The comic to... book based on the Iron Man bobblehead will be late. Oh, there you go. So 
That's it for Ship Shape for this week. We're done right here. Be sure to stop by the store this Wednesday, 8 a.m. is when we open up for new comics. Every Wednesday, 8 a.m. And here at 8 p.m., 12 hours worth of fun, door, and, fun and savings. 15% off all new comics. 40% off those seven titles I mentioned at the top of the store. If you need to hear more about it or read more about it, www.myalternaterally.com. Until next time, this is Comic Book Man saying... <laughs>